Hello everyone, it's me DC and welcome to another tutorial video. This is gonna be a fast and short one, uh, I hope. Uh, the, we'll, we'll go for it. This guy, Wandering Trader, now in Hermitcraft, what we have is this guy trades their hats now, instead of uh, them getting their hats only by getting killed by players. So, what we're gonna do is gonna change the, uh, the hats they sell. So basically, now they can only sell test, and I'm gonna show you how I did that. And how you can add your own hats and your friends hats and all that kind of stuff remove the hermit hats or add the hermit's hat uh, I will just show you how, how it works So first of all what you're gonna do is you're gonna exit your game because you don't want to mess it, mess with stuff whenever your game is open it doesn't work it doesn't let you save uh, then we go to Exumavoid.com and we go to data packs and you download The wandering trading pack there we go. It's there. You just download it and voila you have it whenever you have this file you're gonna go into your file, Wandering Trades, right? You have the zip file. And you make sure you open this with either 7-zip or WinRAR. Open it with those two. Change it in here. If you don't change it in here, it doesn't work. For one weird reason, uh, if you edit it in here, it will 9 out of 10 times just work. You go into Data, WT, Functions, and then Add Trade uh, MC Function. And that's where you're gonna have to change a lot of, well not a lot of stuff, you can just copy paste it basically. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna edit this. So, whenever we're here, you see execute if score, blah 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 You will see here to eight, uh, 28 heads. And you see all the hermit's name behind it. So this number will be 28 probably, uh, or 2 to 28. It always starts with 2, keep that in mind. So, basically what's gonna happen here. I already did a little test. I uh, found a player. There's the player in Minecraft that's called Test. Uh, well, I added his hat to the game. That's basically the hat I showed you in here. Uh, let's see. This hat. Let's test his hat. You see? It's a funny hat. Good one. All right. So we have that hat. All right. I added it to the game. I'm going to edit another one. I will just show you how it works. So basically, you will just copy this line right completely and you change that to tree so if you want to add more lines to the to the thing itself you're just going to edit this line again uh so there we go i'm going to add another one another one so just make sure you change those first values to uh, three uh, four and five and then you can edit the hats itself you see the hermits you can just override them you're going to override from name so what you're going to do you're going to go to Minecrafthats.com. I will leave a link in the description below. Uh, and you're gonna type in a name you want. There's probably someone that's called LOL. I'm fairly sh certain there's someone that's called LOL. Because why wouldn't there be? We're gonna load them in. LOL, that's the head of LOL. You're gonna go to the Minecraft 1.16 Plus version. You're gonna copy this into a notepad. Because you cannot just select a certain uh, thing in here. It's locked. Uh, and what you're gonna copy is very simple. It's right here. It's a name. So bracket name all the way to the bracket over there. So you have this entire clunk. You take that and you go back into your 7-zip uh, file. So there we go. Or your WinRAR, whatever you use to edit. Uh, and you're basically going to copy this part over. So you're going to copy this entire part with your own head or your friend's head or your friend's name. You're going to copy that over. So there we go. You copy it over. And there we go. Now, uh, LOL is added to the game as I had. And I will show you in a bit. I will add those other two too. Uh, just so you get the point, you're gonna fill in your name. Mine says DC Deckard. Uh, need to type it right. There we go, DC Deckard. I want to have my skull name be. You can also change that. You can also call your skull name differently. So whenever you hover over it in the Wandering Trader, it has a different name. But I want to have it just DC Deckard. So we'll just type it twice. Create gift code. We're gonna copy this Minecraft 1.16 plus uh, link. We're gonna throw it in here. So that's a new one. You see, it's a name DC Deckard is mine. I'm gonna copy this over to this bracket. No, you, you can always also go to the uh, to the little bars there. Doesn't really matter. You copy this and you copy this over the third name in this case. There we go. All right, and here we go. You have that gone over. So here we go. DC Deckard is added to, uh, and we do another one. Let's say. Uh, we'll go uh, with a friend of mine. Let's go with Z Boons. There we go. The one I built the Colosseum with. Get his coat. There's his hat. Copy this into my notepad. 
So I can select the only thing I need, and that's a name all the way to the final bracket. Or not the last bracket, but a bit before. We copy this, and we're going to draw it over here. There we go. I'm done. Finished. So what are you going to do right now? You have those hats in there, right? So we have Boons, DC, we have LOL and Test. And those four hats are now in there. We save it. Control S. Save the file. If you don't use shortcuts, cuts, just go here and go to save. Sorry, it's in Dutch, so you won't read it. That's why I did Ctrl S. Uh, and you get out of here. And now it's going to ask, like, do you want to... Uh, well, file add was modified. Do you want to update this? Yep, I want to. Then you go to the second file before you open it. You go to provide hermit traits. And you open this, or you edit this. And you go to... Seventh line in here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Scoreboard player set map input two is gonna be the last one you edit. So edit three, four, and five. So this is gonna be five. This is gonna be a boons number. It's gonna be the last number you edit. After this, the micro blocks come. So make sure you change this. If you don't change it, it don't it doesn't work. So we're gonna save this too. Save. Go out and edit this. There we go. Now we go back in our game. I'm gonna show. I'm uh, gonna see if it works. So we go to our glass test world. Hello, there I am. We're gonna spawn a new trader in. And there we go. We have law in there and easy decorat. Look at it. You can also remove the micro box if you want to. You just remove the files underneath. There we have test and law in there. Let's see if we can get boon too. They're all four of them. Nice. Test, Boon, DC, and LOL. So that's basically how you uh, add your own heads to uh, to the Wandering Traders and remove the other heads. So if I want to remove Test, I will just remove his line. Make sure it always starts with two. That That's very important. And uh, out of that, th that's literally how you do it. That's how simple it is. So if you have any more questions, leave them below in the comment section. And I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Peace out, everyone. Goodbye.